Mum? Yes, Otie? Why do you sit on paddleboard? I sit because I don't have very good balance. I haven't what got what they call core muscles. Muscles? You have. You've got very good ones. I got good balance. I was born with a condition called exomphalus. Exomphalus? I know, silly long word. In other countries, they call it omphalocele. Awful seal. That's seal. easier to say. Hmm. But it means, the way my brother described it, I know, Uncle Craig. Hi, Uncle Craig. I was born inside out. What? A lot of my internal organs, my bowel and liver and things, were outside of my body. And they all had to be put back in and sewn in. And that was great. The brilliant surgeons did that and kept me alive. Life is good. Yeah, that's good, isn't it? But there wasn't any room for any muscle and a few other things. I know. No muscles. And that's why sometimes we do things a bit, little bit differently. I can't always breathe as well as I'd like because my organs are pushing up into my chest. Breathing is good. I know. But that's okay because that means when we go out walking, you get time to sniff and play in the water, don't you? Sniffy, sniffy, splash, splash. You know what, Otie? We're all a bit different. You don't have enough pause. And the main thing is it doesn't stop us doing anything. Even if we have to do it a little bit differently, we do things our way. But thank you so much for asking, Otie. You're welcome. Shall we carry on with our paddle now? You paddles are watch. Yeah. You've got more questions. Yep, more questions. You can ask me anything, you know that. Where's the ducks? I was born in 1981. You is old. And we didn't have all the fancy scans and everything they've got now. So when I was born, it was a bit of a surprise to my parents. Surprise! Yeah. Yep, I got wrapped up in cling film. Yeah, that's for cooking. Put in a helicopter. And sent off to a more specialist hospital. Then, eight operations later, last one when I was about five years old, I had no problems, pretty much, apart from things like learning how to get off the floor and doing things a bit differently, for probably 25 years. Very long time. And then I started to get a few issues. I've now got hernias that I'm hoping can be repaired. And because I'd had a very active life. More active? Yes, before you I had collie wobbles, didn't I? Dear collie wobble. I worked with horses, carriage driving and riding, and worked with sheep and cows. And all of that was quite tough work. And my back hurt. So that's part of why I've changed careers now. That's why we work on the railway. But it means we get to go on more adventures, doesn't it? Because my back doesn't hurt anymore. So we can go off exploring. Lots of adventures and explorings. If anyone has any questions, OT. I do, I do. Other than you, there are some brilliant Facebook pages. If you put in Omphalocele or Exomphalus. And I'm always happy to answer any questions. Hopefully that tells you a bit more, O.T. You know why Mummy does things a little bit differently sometimes now? No, tummy muscles mean sore Thank back. Thank for asking. Good girl. Let's carry on then. Just to finish off, I have included a few photos of me as a baby with the exomphalus. For those of you who'd like to have a look, for those who wouldn't, please skip past them. Happy International Omphalocele Day!